Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That's me. Happy Wednesday. Coming at you with 2021 TriStar Best of All Time. Boat. Multi-sport break. Random hit number one. It's only four hits in the case here. And the potential for, for big hits is pretty high. They only made 80 cases out of here. So, let's see. Very big thanks to this uh, group of people. Robert, Gail, Jonathan, Will. Thank you for giving this a shot. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna open the cases back here. And the case, it's kind of heavy. 37 out of 80. We're gonna pop that case open. I'm gonna pull things out. Just I'm just gonna randomly grab whatever I see first and pull it out of the case. Show you all the hits. We'll pause video, type in all the hits. Right, that's the international symbol for, for typing. And then we'll randomize your names, randomize the hits, and we'll match you up, hopefully, with something really awesome. So let's flip over to the main screen right here. Let's pop that case open. Let's see what we got. Good luck. Make sure nothing's hiding in there. All right, first thing I see is a football helmet. All right, who are you? There you go. TriStar usually has a, has a game show style card right here. So who am I? Who am I? I'm Joe, but who is here? Eight-time Pro Bowl selectee, two-time AP NFL MVP, a AP Associated Press NFL Comeback Player of the Year award winner, a four-time Super Bowl champion, and a three-time Super Bowl MVP. I'm part of the NFL 75th anniversary all-time team and the 100th anniversary all-time team. Part of the 1980s All-Decade Team, your 1990 Sports Illustrated Man of the Year, ranked number four on the NFL.com Players of All Time, and obviously a Hall of Famer with those numbers. There you go, TJ. Who am I? I'm Joe. Joe Cool. Nice. And it looks like it's in his college, it's his college helmet. That's pretty sweet. There's his autograph right there. And there's the, the gold dome of the Notre Dame helmet. It says uh, Irish on that badge right up there. It's got a plexiglass bottom. All right, it's pretty cool. Display ready. It's pretty awesome. Here's another look at the autograph. On, the, on my face camera right there, different angle. That's pretty sweet. I guess I could type these in as I go along. So autographed Notre Dame helmet, full sized. All right, next thing I saw was this jersey right here. Saw the red team, who am I? I'm a 13 time pro bowler and 10 time Associated Press first team all pro selectee a three-time Super Bowl champion, a two-time NFL Offensive Player of the Year, part of the NFL 75th and 100th anniversary teams, and part of the 80s and 90s All-Decade team. My number retired and rated number one NFL player of all time by NFL.com, college and pro football Hall of Famer. 
Who am I? There you go. Logan's got it. Joe Montana's teammate, Jerry Rice. It's got a pretty cool autograph. Right on the edge of that zero. Uh, there's the TriStar sticker right there. And I think this is a custom jersey. So I'll just leave it nicely folded in there, yeah. It's a custom jersey, so probably much easier to frame without covering any of the, the logos or anything like that. But very cool. We've got a special redemption in here. So that means something that couldn't fit inside that case. All right, that's pretty cool. It's an autographed baseball bat. Who am I? I'm a retired baseball player, right-hander from Boston, played first base, career 297 batting average, 2,314 hits, 449 home runs, and 1,529 runs batted in. Played for one team my entire career, four-time All-Star, an NL MVP, an NL Rookie of the Year, a Gold Glover, a three-time Silver Slugger, was an NL RBI leader, and inducted into the Hall of Fame with 86.2% of the vote on my uh, seventh ballot. Right, not Ted Williams, not Joe Cronin, not Ortiz. I did say righty, and I did say NL MVP, one-time NL MVP, and a Hall of Famer on, on my seventh ballot. Funnily enough, so I was born in Boston, right? And uh, I was actually drafted by the Red Sox, but I did not play a big league game with them. This is probably one of the biggest, uh, biggest trade goofs, I guess, of all time. Although I guess he maybe probably wasn't playing well when he was traded, but but yeah, yep. TJ's got it, and PJ, TJ and PJ, Jeff Bagwell. There it is, an autographed baseball bat with Hall of Fame inscribed on there. That's pretty awesome. Game model as well. That's a nice looking bat. Right, just scratch off the code, follow the directions, and they'll they'll send all that off to you. For that stupid reliever, yeah, it was it was crazy. Yeah, they selected him in nine in the eighty nine MLB draft. I guess he didn't play very well, but late in the nineteen ninety season, the Red Sox who were in search of relief pitching to improve their chance of making the playoffs contacted the Astros about Larry Anderson. So what do we know about Larry Anderson? Not much. We know a lot about, about Jeff Bagwell, though. So that's a redemption. And I think TriStar usually has all of those in stock already. So the, the redeeming process should be fairly quick. And the last thing here... 
What is this? It doesn't feel like a photo, but it's in a photo kind of envelope. And that's just a little extra piece of cardboard on the bottom. Okay, interesting. What is this? All right. Who am I? I was born in 1914 and died in 1999. Three time AL MVP. 13 time all. Oh, these are going to give it all away. 13 time All Star and nine time World Series champion. A two time AL home run, RBI, and batting champion. I've had brothers. In the uh, in the major leagues, my number retired. I'm a Hall of Famer. If I give you these two other clues, it'll be really obvious. Who am I? Yeah, it didn't feel like a photo, but it's. Oh, this is a nice. Uh... Oh, it's a it's a nice cut here. Yeah, Joe DiMaggio. Yeah, I mean, if I gave you the other two clues, married to actress Marilyn Monroe and holds the hit streak record at 56 consecutive games, I mean, that would have really given it away. Yeah, TJ and Brian, TJ got it first. And then Brian Peoples. Nice one, TJ. And look at this. This is a pretty cool cut auto. So some some legal document here, some sort of some sort of will legal document that's already been executed, I guess. And then of course PSA DNA authentic autograph right there. That's pretty sweet. That's a clean looking autograph too. Not off some check or anything like that, off a legal document. That's really nice. All right, so two Joe, the all J's, Joe, Jerry, Jeff, and Joe. So it's a, it's a good good break there, good good break for the Joes and the J's. All right, once again, Robert, Gail, Jonathan, and Will, thank you for getting in on this, and good luck. We're gonna roll it. We're gonna randomize both lists, five and a five, ten times, hard ten. Good luck. Your names first. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. We got Will, Gail, Robert, and Jonathan. All right, ten times for the hits. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and tenth and final time. We got the Montana down to the Jerry. It's Joe, Jeff, Joe, Jerry. All right, well, congrats to all four. These are all excellent hits. Will with the Joe Montana autographed Notre Dame full-size helmet, which is pretty sweet. Gail with the Jeff Bagwell autographed baseball bat redemption. Robert with the Joe DiMaggio cut auto. And Jonathan with the Jerry Rice autographed custom jersey. Let's take another quick look at all the hits again. There's the Joe DiMaggio. Pretty nice stuff. There's the redemption for the bat. Nice autographed bats are always pretty sweet. There's the autographed Joe Montana helmet. It's got a got got a base for you already right there. And the helmet has like a nice metallic sheen under it too. It's pretty sweet. 
kind of a heavy helmet, too. It feels a little bit heavier than the other full-size helmets we've seen. Joe Montana has a great autograph right there. And, of course, the Jerry Rice jersey. So, nice. Thanks, everybody. Uh, I think that's it. We've got one more case in the store, and I think it was down to two the last time I... It's sold out now, so we'll have another one coming up a little bit later tonight. I'm Joe for jazpiececasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.